Every now and then, the ocean often decides to share its mysteries with us, casting ashore items that range from the awe-inspiring to the downright chilling. Beaches around the world have become showcases for these oceanic oddities, turning casual strolls along the sand into adventures into the unknown. Not only is this the, the most complete ichthyosaur skeleton ever found, the biggest one ever found here in the UK, incredible, 10 meters long, but it's actually the biggest prehistoric reptile skeleton ever found. Whether it's natural phenomena or the remnants of human history, these finds showcase the vast, unexplored depths that lie just beyond our reach. Here are 20 strangest things washed up on beaches. Number 20, Megalodon Tooth. The Megalodon, an apex predator, long extinct for over three million years, is often visualized as a colossal version of the modern great white shark. While some thrill-seekers fantasize about its continued existence in the unseen depths of the ocean, this conflicts with scientific understanding of deep-sea life and adaptations. Megalodon, whose fossilized teeth are its most famous remnants, preferred shallow coastal waters, as evidenced by the fossils we've found typically alongside marine mammals akin to those hunted by today's great whites. The causes of its extinction are debated, with changes in ocean temperature, prey scarcity, and competition from new predators like the great white shark, all likely playing a role. The lingering mystery of the megalodon's existence only heightens the excitement of related discoveries. In 2022, the excitement was palpable when a nine-year-old from Maryland found a five-inch megalodon tooth on Christmas Day. Molly Sampson, the sharp-eyed young fossil enthusiast, made the find on the shores of Calvert Cliffs State Park along the Chesapeake Bay, an area rich in paleontological history. Already an experienced hunter with hundreds of shark teeth to her credit, Molly's discovery was taken to Stephen Godfrey, a paleontology curator at the Calvert Marine Museum. Godfrey confirmed the tooth's origin, cementing the find as a significant piece of prehistoric puzzle. Number 19, whale excrete. Imagine walking on the beach and stumbling upon something that could change your life. This was the reality for Ken Willman during a casual stroll with his dog on Lancashire Beach. What caught his dog's attention and initially repelled Ken due to its foul odor turned out to be a yellow, waxy lump. Initially dismissive of the smelly find, curiosity got the better of him. After returning home, a quick internet search revealed that this unpleasant lump could be none other than whale excreta, also known as ambergris. To his astonishment, Ken discovered that this substance wasn't just a bizarre beach find, but a valuable commodity, prized by perfumeries across Europe. Ambergris, produced in the digestive system of sperm whales, serves a crucial function. It protects the whale's intestines from the sharp beaks of squid, their primary food source. Contrary to popular belief, ambergris is excreted rather than vomited and can float in the ocean for years before reaching the shore. Ken's discovery was a 66-pound pile of this floating gold, estimated to be worth an astounding $180,000. Ambergris is coveted for its ability to fix scents to the skin, making perfumes last longer. Number 18. Mystery Sea Creature The shores of Cyprus and Spain have witnessed their fair share of unusual marine wash-ups, but a recent discovery has left locals and scientists alike scratching their heads. On a quiet beach in Oleiros, Spain, a passerby stumbled upon a sight both fascinating and unsettling. A beaked whale measuring an impressive six meters in length. This wasn't an isolated incident. It marked the third such discovery that week, raising alarm and curiosity. Beaked whales are known for their elusive nature, typically surfacing on beaches only once every five years, making this series of events even more puzzling. The Cyprus government initiated an investigation following the mysterious appearance of seven beaked whales along their coasts, an unprecedented number that hinted at a deeper environmental or ecological issue. Eyewitnesses reported difficulty in identifying the creatures at first glance, with their distorted bodies bearing little resemblance to the living animals they once were. Beaked whales usually inhabit areas far from the shoreline, about 200 miles into the ocean. The sight of them washed up, lifeless, was seen by many as an ominous sign, especially considering the sporadic reports of similar incidents in 2021 and 2022. 
Experts are delving into the cause behind these unusual strandings, with a focus on how human-induced factors like underwater noise pollution might be disorienting these creatures. Beaked whales rely on echolocation to navigate the dark depths of the ocean. Exposure to intense acoustic disturbances can lead them to surface too quickly, resulting in decompression sickness, a condition that could explain the tragic end these majestic animals have met far from their natural deep-sea home. Number 17. U-Boat In Hastings, a startling discovery transformed a regular morning into a historical spectacle when locals found a German U-Boat, known as a Kiter's U-Boat, washed up along their shores. This U-Boat, drawing curiosity and amazement, quickly became a viral sensation, attracting thousands to the beach, eager for a closer look at this relic from the past. Sensing an opportunity, the Admiralty decided to charge an entrance fee, allowing people to explore the deck of the submarine, with two Coast Guard members acting as guides. However, this excitement was short-lived. Tragically, the two Coast Guards who had been providing tours fell ill and passed away under mysterious circumstances. Their sudden deaths cast a shadow over the submarine, leading to a halt in the tours. Later investigations revealed a grim cause. Chlorine gas leaking from the submarine's batteries had fatally harmed the men, causing severe damage to their lungs and brains. The submarine, identified as SMU-118, had a notable history. Launched on May 8, 1918 from the AG Vulcan shipyard in Hamburg and commanded by Herbert Stowasser, its service was cut short when World War I ended on November 11, 1918. Post-war, it was surrendered to France and was destined to be scrapped. However, fate had other plans. While being towed through the English Channel on April 15, 1919, it broke loose during a storm and ran aground near Hastings. Due to its close proximity to the public beach, using explosives to remove it was deemed too risky, leaving the U-boat stranded and becoming an unintended, albeit temporary, local attraction. Number 16, 250-year-old Swivel Gun On an ordinary day at Dundee Beach, southwest of Darwin in Australia's Northern Territory, a teenager made an extraordinary find. He unearthed a swivel gun, a type of small cannon, that experts believe had been resting under the sea for nearly two and a half centuries. This discovery is remarkable, not just because of the gun's age, but because such weaponry was unheard of in Australia before Captain James Cook's arrival in 1770. The bronze cannon, measuring 107 centimeters in length, was revealed during a particularly low tide, hidden until then beneath the sand. This find has excited scientists and historians alike including Australian researcher Tim Stone. He described the cannon as one of the most significant historical artifacts ever found in northern Australia. Initially, there was speculation that the cannon could date back to the 16th century, possibly linking it to early Portuguese seafarers. Further analysis, however, suggests that the swivel gun might have been lost around 250 years ago, perhaps during the early days of the Macassan trade. These traders from Indonesia were known to visit Australian shores in search of trepang or sea cucumber, a prized delicacy. Another theory posits that the cannon could have come from an Indonesian vessel that ended up on Australian shores due to a storm. Ongoing research aims to determine the specific type of bronze used to cast the gun. The outcomes of these tests are anticipated to provide clearer insights into the cannon's origins and precise age. Number 15 giant plastic pipes. In 2017, an unusual maritime incident caused quite the spectacle on the English coast when huge plastic pipes were found on the beaches of Norfolk. These weren't your typical pipes. They were enormous, ranging from 8 feet in diameter to an incredible 1,500 feet long. They originated from part of a batch being shipped from Norway to Algeria for a big construction project. But here's where the story takes a turn worthy of a seafaring adventure. A container ship collided with the pipe's toe, setting them adrift across the sea. This accidental release led the pipes on an unexpected voyage, ending up scattered across beaches like Sea Pauling and Winterton. Despite their overwhelming size, local officials quickly assured the public that the pipes were safe, posing no threat of pollution. They became an instant attraction, with even children taking to them as an enormous, unexpected playground by the sea. 
The task of retrieving these sea-traveled giants involved a careful process. Each pipe was first gathered together off the coast and then transported back to Norway. The operation was successful with not a single problem, ensuring the pipe's journey ended as suddenly as it began and the Norfolk coast returned to its usual state. Number 14. Football Fish Encountering a football fish on your beach walk would certainly be a startling experience. This deep-sea dweller, more formally known as an anglerfish, recently caught beachgoers in California by surprise. Far from being a creature of science fiction, the football fish thrives in the abyssal darkness of the ocean, usually found around 3,000 feet below the surface, making its appearance on sandy shores a rare event. The Pacific football fish, a variant of the anglerfish, is cloaked in black with a body that's both gelatinous and rugged. It features minuscule eyes, a vast mouth filled with sharp teeth, and most notably, a luminous lure extending from its head. This bioluminescent lure is used to attract prey, illuminating the pitch-black waters of its deep-sea home. Interestingly, only the females boast this glowing appendage and can reach up to 24 inches in length, contrasting sharply with the diminutive males, which only grow to about one inch. The reproductive habits of these fish are as alien as their appearance. Males become parasites. They attach themselves to females, eventually becoming a permanent part of the female, save for their reproductive organs. This bizarre mating strategy is a necessity in the vast emptiness of the deep sea, where finding a mate is a formidable challenge. Number 13. Giant Driftwood Driftwood on the beach usually brings to mind small, weathered pieces of wood, not the colossal tree that landed on La Push, Washington's shores. The image of a man dwarfed by this gigantic tree might trick you into thinking it's all about perspective, but make no mistake. This tree is genuinely enormous, with a diameter ranging between 5 and 10 feet. It's the kind of natural marvel that draws photographers and nature lovers alike, eager to capture its grandeur. However, the presence of such a massive piece of driftwood isn't without its challenges. Due to its size, the tree takes a significantly long time to break down naturally leaving local authorities the task of dealing with this gargantuan driftwood. In a related discovery, a woman finds massive tree washed ashore. Then she sees a carved warning message on the trunk. Number 12. Sea Dragon In 2021, a seemingly ordinary task at Rutland Water Nature Reserve in the UK turned into a historic event when Joe Davis, leading the conservation team, uncovered something remarkable. He discovered the fossilized remains of an ichthyosaur, affectionately known as a sea dragon. This discovery was unprecedented, not just for its rarity, but because it was the largest and most complete ichthyosaur skeleton ever found in Britain. Aged over 180 million years and stretching beyond 32 feet in length, it stands among the oldest and most significant finds of its kind. Ichthyosaurs were marine reptiles that dominated the Jurassic Seas about 250 million years ago, existing concurrently with dinosaurs. Known as the ocean's apex predators, they could grow up to 25 meters long and were armed with sharp teeth designed for hunting. The Rutland Ichthyosaur, identified as a Temnodontosaurus trigonodon, is especially notable for its well-preserved state, offering a near-complete skeleton a rare occurrence for creatures of such immense size. The excavation of this sea dragon was a meticulous effort, involving both professional and amateur paleontologists. They embarked on a detailed process to carefully unearth, document, and safely extract this ancient relic. Number 11. Mysterious Metal Ball In early 2023, the serene Enshu Beach in Hamamatsu, Japan, became the landing spot for an enigmatic object that caught the eye of locals and experts alike, a massive metal ball. Measuring about 60 inches in diameter, this iron sphere piqued curiosity and speculation across the nation. Utilizing X-ray technology, investigators were able to determine that the sphere was hollow, alleviating initial fears that it might be an unexploded mine. The origins of the mysterious orb remained a puzzle, with local authorities and media at a loss. Theories abounded regarding its purpose and where it might have originated, drawing attention from specialists across various fields. Despite their thorough examinations, the true nature of the metal ball remained elusive. 
Its dark metallic luster and significant size fueled wild speculation about its origins, ranging from extraterrestrial artifacts and secretive government projects to debris from a meteorite. Yet, in the absence of definitive evidence, the idea of it being a piece of space debris lingered in the air. Number 10. Harley-Davidson Bike In the wake of natural disasters, the devastation unfolds on an unimaginable scale, with communities shattered and priceless possessions lost amidst the chaos. The 2011 tsunami in Japan was a reminder of nature's fury, leaving behind a trail of destruction and loss. Amid such tragedies, personal stories of loss and recovery emerge, bringing a human aspect to the catastrophe. For Ikuo Yokoyama, the tsunami meant the heartbreaking loss of three family members, overshadowing the disappearance of his beloved Harley-Davidson motorcycle. Remarkably, the story took an unexpected turn when, a year after the disaster, Peter Mark found the motorcycle over 3,000 miles away on Graham Island in Canada. The bike, encased in a storage unit, had been battered by its journey across the ocean, its once pristine condition lost to rust and wear. Yet, the discovery of Yokoyama's Harley-Davidson became a symbol of resilience amid the widespread destruction. The motorcycle's recovery captured the public's attention, and a Harley-Davidson representative in Japan reached out to Yokoyama, offering to return and restore the bike to its former glory. Grateful for the gesture, Yokoyama accepted, and the motorcycle was transported back to him. Number 9. Dwarf Sperm Whale Skull In 2021, the shores of New Jersey became the site of an intriguing discovery that sparked widespread curiosity and debate. A mysterious skull, with its massive size and unconventional shape, was found washed up on the beach, this enigmatic find led to a whirlwind of speculation among both the general public and scientific community, with theories ranging from evidence of an ancient giant race to the remnants of a long-extinct dinosaur. However, after thorough examination by marine experts, the true identity of the skull was revealed. It belonged to a dwarf sperm whale, a species known to inhabit our oceans yet remains somewhat elusive to our understanding. The skull measured over three feet in length and weighed in at more than 300 pounds, making it a remarkable find by any measure. Number 8. Bananas On an unexpected day in 2007, visitors to two Dutch North Sea islands were greeted by an unusual sight, far removed from the typical seashells and sandcastles one might expect to find. Thousands of bananas had washed ashore, a surreal scene sparked by a maritime mishap during a storm. Reports detailed how at least six containers had tumbled from a cargo ship, with one bursting open to release its fruity cargo into the sea. The incident, taking place on Terschelling Island, situated 70 miles north of Amsterdam, turned the beach into an impromptu banana buffet. This was not the first time the shores had seen unusual debris. Over the years, everything from children's toys to aluminum briefcases and tennis shoes had made unexpected appearances. However, the sight of endless bananas was a first, surpassing even the surprise of finding a load of sweaters two decades prior. Locals and beachcombers alike hurried to collect the unripe bananas, unconcerned with how long they would take to ripen. While it remained a mystery what became of the bananas left behind, Speculation suggested they might have found a new home in nearby zoos, providing an unexpected feast for the resident monkeys. Number 7. 200-foot-long tanker In May 2016, an astonishing discovery was made along the shores of West Africa when a gigantic oil tanker, later identified as the Tamaya One, mysteriously washed ashore. Stretching over 206 feet in length, this leviathan from the deep found its final resting place on the sands of Robertsport, Liberia, far from the bustling sea lanes from which it had ventured. The phenomenon of ships and tankers becoming stranded isn't unheard of, yet the story of the Tamaya one diverges from the norm in several puzzling ways. Remarkably, the vessel was discovered completely abandoned, with not a single crew member found on board. Its journey had begun in Panama, and it was last sighted navigating waters well clear of any known pirate activity, eliminating the usual suspects behind such maritime mysteries. Speculation abounds regarding the ship's fate, with theories ranging from financial woes plaguing the vessel's owner, potentially leading to an unpaid and therefore mutinous crew, 
to more sinister undertones suggested by the discovery of a fire within the captain's quarters. Such clues hint at a darker narrative, perhaps involving foul play. The Liberian Maritime Authority was left to speculate about the true story behind the tanker's abrupt abandonment. Before any concrete answers could be unearthed, the vessel fell prey to local looters and vandals, further clouding the ship's secrets beneath layers of human interference. Number 6. Mysterious Blue Creature A particularly unusual event captured the attention of visitors on Australian beaches, where the discovery of a mysterious blue creature sparked curiosity and alarm. On a day that began like any other, with people enjoying the sun, sand, and sea, the tranquil beach atmosphere was suddenly disrupted by the appearance of this alien-like blue entity. The creature was unlike anything the visitors had ever encountered, drawing a mix of fascination and apprehension. Some of the more daring individuals decided to investigate by picking the creatures up directly from the sand, a decision they would soon regret. Without any warning or knowledge of the creature's nature, these curious souls were subjected to severe pain in their palms, leading to widespread panic among the onlookers. The local community was left pondering the origins and dangers of this unknown marine animal. Promptly, marine experts were called upon to shed light on this enigma. They identified the creature as a blue-bottle jellyfish, a species known to frequent Australian shores during the summer months. While not poisonous, the sting of a blue-bottle jellyfish can be intensely painful, with the discomfort potentially lasting up to two hours and sometimes resulting in joint aches. In light of this revelation, beachgoers were strongly advised to exercise caution and avoid any contact with these creatures, as the long-term effects could prove to be quite serious. The blue-bottle jellyfish's presence on beaches has had significant impacts in the past, with over 3,239 reported stings in the year 2019 alone. To minimize the risks posed by these jellyfish, the public is encouraged to heed warnings and avoid swimming in areas known to be inhabited by them. Before we move on, here's today's subscriber's pick. In the image, we see a woman standing beside a colossal tree trunk that has been washed ashore. The sheer size of the tree is awe-inspiring, dwarfing the woman who stands next to it. The woman finds the massive tree washed ashore, then she sees a carved warning message on the trunk. Carved into its trunk were symbols and runes that appeared to belong to no known language. By the time she decided to document this intriguing find more closely, the tree had vanished. Could this tree have borne ancient carvings, much like the hunger stones that emerged to reveal dire warnings during droughts? The true nature of the message and its origins remain a mystery lost to the tides before it could be deciphered. Share your thoughts in the comment section. Number 5. Tarballs For years, the phenomenon of mysterious tarballs washing ashore has puzzled and troubled communities around the globe, from the sunny coasts of Manhattan Beach, California, to the historic Mediterranean shores of Israel. These dark, sticky remnants from the ocean are not only a nuisance, but pose significant risks to both wildlife and humans due to the toxic substances they contain. Tar balls are essentially hardened lumps of oil that vary in size, from tiny specks barely measuring 0.2 inches to sizable globs several inches across. Their appearance on beaches signals underlying environmental issues, often linked to oil spills that have far-reaching consequences on marine ecosystems. One notable incident occurred in May 2015 when Manhattan Beach had to be closed after being inundated with these hazardous blobs. Investigations pointed to an oil pipeline leak as the culprit behind the tarball's appearance. However, this event is far from isolated. In 2023, the coast of Israel witnessed a significant... Number 4. Amazon River Monster the discovery of a deceased Amazon River giant, often dubbed the River Monster, near Florida's Gulf Coast, sent ripples of concern through local communities. Encounters with such exotic creatures are exceedingly uncommon, sparking speculation about the circumstances that led to its appearance. This particular specimen raised the alarm over the potential establishment of a new invasive species within Florida's ecosystem. Known scientifically as Arapaima, these river monsters hail from the Amazon basin and are renowned for being the largest freshwater fish in the world. They can stretch up to 10 feet in length and weigh as much as 440 pounds. The presence of such a formidable creature outside its natural habitat is alarming and prompts serious environmental and ecological questions. 
Arapaimas are not just notable for their size, they exhibit remarkable parental behavior, constructing nests in floodplains and diligently nurturing their offspring. They reach sexual maturity between the ages of three and five. The sighting of a dead Arapaima in Florida led to concerns among scientists about the adaptability of these giants to new environments. The fear is not just for the welfare of the Arapaimas, but also for the local marine life, which could be impacted by their introduction. Arapaimas are highly valued for their meat in their native Amazon, where their boneless, easily preserved flesh is a staple in rural communities. However, this demand has led to their overfishing, particularly since they need to surface for air, making them easy targets. Number 3. Stranded Orca In the vastness of the world's oceans, home to an array of marine life, predators like orcas stand at the apex of the underwater food chain. Known as toothed whales, orcas are not only the largest members of the dolphin family, but are also revered as some of the most formidable predators in the sea. Their size and prowess often evoke a sense of awe and caution among divers fortunate or daring enough to encounter them. Despite their strength and independence, there are rare instances when these mighty creatures find themselves in need of help. In 2021, such a moment unfolded on the shores of British Columbia, where a fisherman, acting as a good Samaritan, stumbled upon a 20-foot orca stranded among the rocks. Initially mistaking it for deceased, he soon realized the orca was alive but in distress, prompting him to call for a rescue team. Understanding the gravity of the situation and the risk of the orca falling victim to scavengers, the fisherman stood watch over it, protecting it until help arrived. In an inspiring display of community spirit, Locals and wildlife officials formed a human chain, tirelessly passing buckets of seawater to keep the stranded giant hydrated. After six arduous hours with the aid of the rising tide, the rescue team successfully returned the orca to the ocean. Number 2. Elusive Cannibal Fish In 2023, beachgoers along the Oregon coast experienced the shock of encountering the lancet fish, a deep-sea marvel far from its usual haunting grounds in the ocean's abyss. This scaleless fish, with its formidable fanged jaws and sizable frame, offers a glimpse into the ocean's enigmatic depths, a world that remains largely uncharted and full of mysteries. The lancet fish is not your typical shore find. With a body built like an eel's, adorned with sail-like fins, these creatures habitually dwell over a mile below the sea's surface, in regions ranging from tropical to subtropical climates. Remarkably, they venture as far north as the Bering Sea near Alaska in pursuit of food. Yet their sudden appearance on Oregon sands has puzzled both scientists and the public alike. Why these deep-sea dwellers are getting washed ashore remains an open question. Some researchers propose that the lancet fish might be driven too close to the coastline while hunting prey or evading predators. Others suggest that shifting weather or climate patterns across the Pacific might play a role in this unusual phenomenon. Historically, the appearance of deep-sea creatures in shallow waters has been interpreted as an ominous sign, indicating an imbalance or change in the marine ecosystem. Number 1. Love Letters from World War II during World War II, soldiers sent to the front lines would pen their thoughts and affections, hoping their words would bridge the distance back home. Unfortunately, not all these missives reached their intended recipients, often for reasons as unpredictable as the tides. In a remarkable twist of fate, Kathleen Mullen stumbled upon a piece of this bygone era on the Jersey Shore. She discovered 56 love letters, their pages bound by a pink ribbon brought in by the sea. After bringing them home and carefully drying them, Kathleen unearthed a love story frozen in time. These letters chronicled the heartfelt exchanges between Dorothy Fallon and Lynn Farnham from 1942 to 1945 during Lynn's military service. The journey of these letters from oblivion back to the light of day remains a mystery. However, through diligent online research, Kathleen managed to track down the couple's niece. Dorothy and Lynn's wartime romance had blossomed into marriage post-war, resulting in a family of their own. By the time the letters resurfaced, Lynn and their sons had passed, leaving Dorothy in a New Jersey nursing home. That's all for now. Until next time, bye!